welcome back to my channel. I just got done getting ready for the day. I'm about to get JJ dressed and ready to go. I, th I think we're going to go get some coffee and have like a little breakfast date. And then I need to run a couple errands and just pick up a few things. I want to take them to the park, but it's like 40 degrees outside right now. So it's still pretty cold. So I don't know if we're going to go to the park just because it's so cold and I don't want to take him outside playing in the park when it's freezing outside. So I don't know if we're going to do that. Maybe I'll take him like this afternoon instead. Are you ready? Let's go. So we finally made it in the car after JJ bumping into me as I was. I was putting some Cokes in the refrigerator so that they would be cold later. And JJ was trying to get in the fridge and like bumped into me and made me drop one. So we had Cokes spill everywhere, all over me. It got on JJ's shoes, I had to clean it up. It was all over the floor, all over the refrigerator. I literally just deep cleaned the refrigerator yesterday, like last night at like seven o'clock at night. And I took everything out of the refrigerator, cleaned it out really, really well. And now there's Coke all over it. So I wiped it off as good as I could. I guess I'm gonna clean it out again later. But now we're finally in the car. back in the car from Target. It's always like a hassle going to the store with him now because he doesn't want to sit in the cart the right way and he just is like but I really want to go to Dollar Tree. There's a couple things I want to grab so we're gonna try and do that really quickly and then get back home so that he can take his nap. It's about his nap time so I'm gonna try to go to Dollar Tree just really quickly and then get back home before he starts to like freak out too much. You guys look what's here. Fred's birthday present just came. So excited. Watch out, watch out, go inside, inside. But he wanted a guitar for his birthday, so I let him pick it out. He already knows what he's getting, but it just came. I didn't think it was gonna come until like Friday or Saturday or maybe even Monday, so super excited that it's here. He's gonna be so excited when he gets home. But we just got back home. I'm glad we're back home. I stopped and got Subway for lunch for myself. He's down there playing with the letters on the fridge. You learning your letters? Hey JJ, look at mommy. Can you say cheese? <laughs> cheese, good. <laughs> oh, careful. <laughs> He's getting so good with his words. He's like learning new words every single day. And it's so fun, like watching him and hearing him try to say the words and how fast he picks up on them is just like insane. But he's getting so smart and it's such a fun age like watching him learn all this new stuff. So I didn't really get anything exciting from the store, just some things I needed for my hospital bag, diapers, wipes, random stuff like that. But I did pick up this chocolate cookie kit. It says Moonlit Cottage chocolate cookie kit. And it's kind of just like a gingerbread house, but for Halloween. But I just got the mini one because I know it's not going to be like the easiest thing to do with JJ. But so I just got the small one. I think it was like two or three dollars. And it just like comes with all the stuff you need. Some icing and like a few decoration things. And I thought this would be kind of fun to try with JJ this weekend when Fred's home. So I just picked this up and I think we're going to do that this weekend. So I just laid JJ down for his nap. He did not want to go down. He normally goes down around 1130 and it is... 12:15, so past his nap time so he needed to go down so I didn't give him lunch I just gave him like a bottle of milk I'm sorry if I'm not always like looking to the camera if I'm looking sideways a little bit I'm filming on my phone today 
and it's just weird having to like look to the side to look straight at the camera so it's kind of weird but I have been napping with JJ when he naps because I'm just so tired and I would love to lay down for a nap right now but I'm so hungry so I need to eat and I also really really wanted to film a pregnancy update and the only way I can do that is when he's napping so I might do that but I don't know we'll see I'm gonna eat and then see how I feel after that so baby girl dropped yesterday already I will be 32 weeks I will be 33 weeks in two days so she dropped like pretty early JJ didn't drop until 36 weeks so and then he was born at 40 weeks in three days so she already dropped so I feel like she's gonna come early I feel like she's gonna be here maybe in like a month you know if she's ready to come then that's fine with me because being pregnant with a toddler is no joke and I'm kind of over it so if she comes a little bit early I will not complain so I really wanted to get a pregnancy update filmed and up for you guys because I don't know how many more I'm gonna be doing so I want to get as many up as I can while I'm still pregnant. And then also yesterday I packed her hospital bag. So today I'm going to work on my hospital bag and probably JJ's overnight bag. Because if I do go into labor before my due date, then he's going to go to one of our friends' house and stay with them. So I need to have a bag packed and ready for him as well. Um, if I don't go into labor until my due date or after, we will have family here. We have family coming like the day before my due date I think so if she holds on till then then he'll be with my family but I don't think that she's gonna wait that long I think she's gonna be here at least a couple weeks early I'm just in like full-on nesting mode cleaning everything getting everything ready for whenever she decides to join us but yeah so I'm gonna sit down right now and eat and relax a little bit because I am so worn out from being out this morning with JJ okay so I'm just starting to throw some stuff in my hospital bag this is my toiletry bag. I've kind of been like throwing things in there as I go lately. So I have like a toothbrush for me, toothpaste, some lotion. This I'm going to fill up with my body wash. So if I want to take a shower. And then I picked these up today for my husband. This is a toothbrush and then some deodorant for him. I picked myself up some face wipes. This is just like up and up brand face wipes. And then... This is some like cleansing face oil stuff I've been using lately. I really, really like it. I got this like travel size one to test out and I used it all. So I bought like a big bottle of it today and I just poured a little bit in there to put in my hospital bag. I've got some cotton pads to use with that and then some Q-tips. And then I've got some stuff in here. So like my hospital gown, my little grip socks, and then... I've got myself some chapstick and deodorant that I'm going to put in there. This is a receipt from this bag. I got this bag a while ago because it was on sale at TJ Maxx. And it's Vera Bradley, but I just thought it was so cute and such a like good bag to have so I could use it for my hospital bag. We're going to be PCSing a few months after she's born as well, so I thought it was really good to, to just kind of like have for travel and stuff. And then I'm going to throw this nursing tank top in. I'm going to throw that in there. And I'll just throw this cardigan in there as well. This nursing tank top doesn't really fit me when I'm pregnant right now. Like the stomach. My stomach like hangs out the bottom. So I'm going to throw that one in there because I don't wear it. And then I'm just going to throw my pink cardigan in there because I've been wearing my like rust colored one lately for fall so I'm just gonna put my pink one in there because I haven't really been wearing it so I won't really miss it if it's in my bag. and then my diaper bag which has all of baby girls things I packed hers yesterday so they're right there ready to go just about there's still quite a few things I need to add to my hospital bag but that is what I have for now so I just got done filming my pregnancy update I did not want to do it I just wanted to like lay down and nap but I really wanted to film it and get it up for you guys so I'm glad I did that I don't know if it'll be up before this video or after but if I do post it before today's vlog then I will 
leave it up in the cards so you guys can check it out. And if not, then just keep an eye out because it will be up soon. I will just get these videos up as soon as I can whenever I have the energy to edit. That's been my hardest thing for me lately is like getting the energy to sit down and edit because it takes a while and it takes a lot. And usually I edit at night, but I've been so tired. So I've been going to bed early and stuff, so I haven't like had the energy to stay up late and edit. I have the heater on because it's freezing in here, so hopefully that is not too annoying. But I see JJ starting to wake up now. I was hoping he would nap a little bit longer, but it looks like he's starting to wake up, so I'm gonna have to go get him in a few minutes. I just filled up my big cup with water. I like chugged that thing. It was like full when I came home and I just like chugged it. And now I'm on another one. It's probably like my third one today. I've been drinking so much water. I'm probably just going to sit here on the couch, watch some TV. Whenever JJ wakes up, I'm probably just going to let him watch cartoons for a little while because I just don't feel like doing anything and we're just going to be chilling out because I am so, so tired. So I got him set up over here with some cartoons and some mac and cheese and hot dogs. So he's having that as like a late lunch. He already ate like almost all of his hot dogs. I just filled this up with mostly water and a little bit of juice it's this cute little cup that I got from the dollar spot and it had like a skeleton on it it had a skeleton on it but I hand washed it like twice and like half the skeleton came off but he does so well with this cup like he does not spill it at all and I'm super impressed because I kind of thought it was gonna be a disaster when he used it but he does really well with it and he loves using it I think he feels like a big boy when he uses it so So I just got done cooking dinner. I just made like a stir fry with broccoli and carrots and some steak and then rice on top. And I made like a teriyaki sauce to go with it. JJ, JJ just has rice and soy sauce and carrots. So. You ready to eat? You ready? Yeah. Somebody likes their birthday present. Like a bit. I don't know yet. <laughs> What is it, JJ? Oh, JJ, hold on. Hold on. <laughs> Alright guys, I think I'm going to end the vlog here. We're just hanging out now. He's going to play with his guitar. JJ's playing with his cars. And just kind of chill out the rest of the night. But thank you guys so much for watching today's vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you guys very soon in my next video.